Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Yeah? How are you? I'm pretty good, thank you. It's good to see everybody. Well, well, many of you, because I still, I think we still are missing quite a few people. Okay, how was your day today? You had a good day? Yeah, or not a very good day? Mm -hmm. Good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? I'm well, great. Good. You're very good? Yes, very good. Okay, very good. Excellent, everybody. Okay, so what we're going to do right now is uh, we're going to start by taking the attendance. Okay. Um, okay, just a second. Um, okay, so here we go. Please um, open up your microphone, say present, and then close it again so that we don't um, distract um, the other classmates so we, we don't, we can hear everybody. Okay, so starting, Ana Itzela Janis. Present. Wonderful. Ana Ruth Perez. Ana Ruth Perez. Present. Great. Carlos Ernesto Flores. Carlos Ernesto Flores. Eh, Diana Cristabel Meléndez. Diana Cristabel. Eh, Gerardo José Tepas. I'm here. Okay, very good. José Mauricio Martínez. Present. Okay, very good. Juana Margarita Sea. Buena Margarita Sea. A uh, Catherine Suleima Poca Sangre. Catherine Suleima Poca Sangre. Catherine Nicolás Salazar. Present teacher. Great. A uh, Cathy uh, Jordana Dos Cruces. Katia Jordana Dos Cruces. Um, Lara Lizet Peña. Laura Lizet Peña. Lorena Araceli Hernández. Present teacher. Very good. Melissa Cecilia Beltrán. Melissa Cecilia Beltrán. Um, Mirna del Carmen Ruano. Mirna del Carmen Ruano. Oscar Otoniel Cruz. Presente. Great, right, thank you. Uh, Roberto Carlos Alfaro. Present. Okay, good. Uh, Salvador Antonio Martinez. Salvador Antonio Martinez. Eh, Sebastiana Guadalupe Aguilar. Present, teacher. Great. Tamara Eugenia Aguilar. Tamara Eugenia Aguilar. Eh, Úrsula Adriana Burgos. Oh, wow. Sí. Uh, 
Hace falta un montón. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Sí, les falta un montón, de veras. Ok, bueno. All right, guys and girls. Um, so before we start, or better said, not before we start, to start our class, um, uh, we're going to do the following. We, we have been talking about describing people's appearances. Okay. Um, ya ustedes más o menos se conocen bastante bien, ¿verdad? Yeah, más o menos. Okay, so what we're going to do, remember yesterday I asked you to write in the chat a description about yourself. Do you remember? Yes? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. Good. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to be, I'm going to be a, sending one of the descriptions to the chat and you're going to guess who it's talking about. Okay, so you're going to discuss, you're going to um, a, try to figure out who are we talking about. Does that make sense? Do we understand? Yes. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. All right. Eh, chicos, se pueden encender su camarita. Eh, también porque así podemos ver sus caritas. Y así va a ser mucho más fácil el poder um, adivinar, ¿verdad? Ok, so could you please turn on your, your camera? Ok. All right, so I'm writing the chat, um, the description. Si ven, si ven su descripción, no digan nada, okay? No digan, ah, eso soy yo. <laughs> okay, no, uh, the idea is that we are going to guess. The class is going to guess, okay? So here we go. This is the first description. Okay, so who do you think it is? You can guess, somebody in the class. Mm -hmm. Huh? Guesses, come on. I'm a brute. Yeah, Ruth. Yes, I'm a Ruth Perez. <laughs> I'm a Ruth Perez? Yes. yes. Okay. All right. <laughs> Very good. Bravo. How did you know it's a Ruth? How did you know? Mm, well, I guess, in my opinion. Uh, But why? Her why? Eyes, eyes color. Eyes color. Her eye color? Pero. Yes. Eh, do you know each other in person? No. So, because in by the camera, it's very difficult to see her eye color. In her, no. Huh? In her, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay, good. All right, we're going to go to the next one. All right. I'm sending in the chat right now the next description.
Catering. Catering. You mean Catherine Suleiman? No, Catherine Salazar. Mm, Catherine Salazar. No, it's not Catherine Salazar. No? Mm -mm. Diana? Mm -mm. Not Diana. No. Is it here in the class or? No. Um, nope. <laughs> I already gave half of it away because if they're not in the class, think of the people that are not in the class. It's not in the class. Can you give us a clue? Mm -hmm. Is it is a a boy or it is a girl? It's a girl. It's a girl. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Laura, 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 yeah, it's very good. It's Laura, very good, excellent. Okay, here's the next one. What do you think? Yeah. Come on, guesses. At least a guess. Probably Gerardo. Gerardo? Mm -hmm. Gerardo, is it? Is it Gerardo? Yes, teacher. Is that you, Gerardo? <laughs> I don't know. I, I hope that, but I'm not sure. Did you write that? Mm, no, I don't know. <laughs> is, that, is that your description or no? Mm, to be honest with you, no, because I'm, I'm not very tall. Okay, so no, right? So it's not you. Any others? Uh, Roberto, teacher. Roberto Alfaro. Yeah, very good. Roberto Alfaro. Exactly. Very good. Okay. Um, all right, then choose another one. Okay, here's the other one. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Come on, guess this. What do you think it could be? 
Sebastiana Guadalupe, teacher. Sebastián Guadalupe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. She's like guilty as charged. <laughs> okay, very good. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see the next one. Okay. What about this one? Catherine Nicole or Diana Catherine. Christabel? Which one? Diana. Okay, Diana. Diana Christabel. Catherine. Say it's Catherine. Some people say Diana. What do you think? Okay. Catherine? Diana? Uh, Diana, can you hear us? Yes. Okay, so is that your description? Uh, so, so, my eyes is um, in, my, in my heart. But, but is that your description, yes or no? Yes. That's your description. You wrote that? Yes. You wrote that. You wrote that sentence? What? Diana, did you write that, that, that paragraph, that sentence? Did you write it? These are the descriptions from yesterday. Did you write them? Did you write that sentence? Okay. Um, I am... Que si escribiste ese párrafo, eso es lo que pregunta. That was trying to say. Que si esa es su descripción, que si eso es lo que escribiste. Algo así, o sea, sí. No, what I wrote right now, is that yo solo estoy copiando y pegando lo que me escribieron. Did you write that? O sea, lo escribió. No. Vaya, entonces that's not your description. Uh -huh. <laughs> o sea, si usted no lo escribió eso, entonces no es la descripción suya. Okay. Okay. So, what do you think it is? Catherine Salazar. Catherine? Catherine Salazar, are you there? Yes. Okay. Is that you? Yes. Yes? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, very yes. good. It's her. Very good. Very good. Yes. Excellent. Okay. All right. Let me get another one. Um, okay. Here's the next one. What do you think? What do you think that is? Ana Isola. For me, it's Tamara. Tamara? Is Tamara here? No. Okay. Um, nope, it's not Tamara. Okay. What do you think it is? I guess. Maricela. Maricela? Eh, Maricela is here. Ana, Ana Isela. No. no. Ah, Ana Isela, okay. Yes, <laughs> Maricela, okay, yes. Okay, Ana Isela, is that your description? No, no, teacher. No. 
Oh, sorry, sorry, yes, yes, this is my definition. <laughs> okay, very good. That is your description. Good, excellent. Um, okay, very good. Vamos a ver qué nos falta. Ah. Okay, let's see. Okay. What do you think? But who do you think? Guesses? Hmm. No. Come on, guesses. Come on, guessing. Just a guess. If you're wrong, it's okay. It's not a, nothing's wrong. It's not the end of the world. What do you think? Eh, chicos, les recuerdo ahí de su camarita. No. Uh -huh. Lorena. Lorena. Uh -huh. Lorena, is that you? Lorena, is that you? Lorena Araceli, is that you? Lorena, are you there? Hmm, I don't think it's there. But no, it's not Lorena. I'll tell you that much. It's not Lorena. Who else could it be? Take a guess. Take a guess. If you're wrong, it's okay. Who can it be? Come on, guys and girls. Take a guess. Hey, hello. You can hear me? Yes. Okay. Yes. Wonderful. Who do you think it is? Gerardo, who do you think that is? Gerardo Jose? Yes, I'm here. Uh -huh. Okay. Who do you think that is? Whose description do you think that is? Well, to be honest, I remember the, my other classmate. I know my my classmate that, that I can see right now. I you can see them. I, yes, now I can see, but my other classmate that not here in the class. Oh, the person is here right now. Hmm. So. Maybe you didn't, you didn't see them. Oscar Otoniel. Okay. Oscar Otoniel, is that you? Yes. Yay. Very good. <laughs> Excellent. You guys did a wonderful job. Okay. Okay. All right, guys and girls. I, I wasn't able to get everybody. Todavía creo que me faltan unos cuantos, pero I think you did pretty good. Excellent. Okay. All right, guys and girls, so um, just a little bit of um, something I wanted to clarify is that we never, we don't really say my eyes are color blue, for example. You say my eyes are blue. We don't say color blue. Okay? Like, when, like in Spanish, when you say son de color azul, no. You don't do that in English. You don't translate directly. You don't say, my eyes are color blue. 
You see, my eyes are blue. Okay? Does that make sense? It's okay? Okay. Yes, okay. Okay. Very good, very good. Okay. Let's move on to the next part then. Um, okay, so we continue talking about um, appearance, but this time we're talking about the clothes, the appearance of the clothes. So we're looking at the fashion in the street. And I want you to repeat after me these words. Button down shirt. Button down shirt. Good. I want to hear everybody, not just two people. Button down shirt. Button down shirt. Button down shirt. Very good. Excellent. Okay. A belt. 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 Good. Slacks. 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 Dress shoes. <laughs> Dress shoes. Dress shoes. Dress shoes. Okay. So this is like a classic look. Now let's talk about the cool and casual look. We have jacket. 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 Sweater. Sweater. Everybody sweater. 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 Cargo pants. Cargo pants. Tennis shoes. Tennis shoes. Tennis shoes. Okay, so that's uh, the ca the cool and casual look. Then we have the funky look, which is t-shirt. T-shirt. Purp purse. 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 Played skirt. Played Play. Play. skirt. Mm -hmm. uh, striped tights. Striped, striped tights. Striped tights. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that's it. Okay. And that mm -hmm. is the funky. Do we have any questions about the vocabulary? No. No. You sure? Yes. Okay. All right. So what we're going to do is uh, we have these questions here at the bottom. Which clothing items do you wear almost every day? What are three? What are the three more? Sorry. What are three more things you like to wear? What's your style? Is it classic, cool and casual, funky, or something else? Okay. Okay. All right. So I'm going to ask you to work with a partner and you're going to be discussing these questions. Okay. Um, so let me stop sharing. Okay. Okay, so please tell me if you can see my my, my picture. You see the picture? Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, so we're going to put you guys into breakout rooms. Okay. Um, okay, so let's see. Um, Catherine Nicole, are you going to be able to? Okay, you're going to be able to participate then, right? Yes. Okay, perfect. Um, okay, I'm going to send you to the breaker room so you can practice 
this um or better said you can ask these questions to your partner and you also answer the questions here we go teacher ayandra Hit me. Which clothes clothing items do you wear almost every day? Oh which clothing items do you wear? I wear lo que yo uso todos los días. Ajá. Casi todos los días. Casi todos los días. Um, a t-shirt and okay. pants. Okay. Uh, well, only that. Only day. Only day. Yes. Okay. Well, in my case, I like to wear a uh, t-shirt and shorts and also i like to wear caps and tennis shoes too okay okay and the second question for you what are the three more things you like to wear uh three things uh -huh. uh uh, t um, shirt, uh, okay. usually, usually, and pants. Okay. Um, pants shoes or tennis. Tennis shoes. Okay. Uh, what That's do you good. say? Uh, what do you say in English? Uh, tacones. High heels. Okay. okay. Uh huh. High heels. Okay. In my in castle, um, I use belt and bottom down shirt. Okay. But I used tennis shoes, no breast shoes. Okay. Yeah. What are three more things you like to wear? Um, I like to wear t-shirt and tennis shoes and shirt to. Okay. What's your style? It is classic, cool and casual, funky, something else. Um cool and casual, I I think. Funky no no more. Okay. Is right. finished, right? Yeah, we're finished. Yeah. Sure. Okay. I'll take you to the main room in a moment.
Okay. Um, all right, so uh, any questions about the vocabulary, pronunciation? Tacones, teacher. Oh, hi, hi, high heels? Yes, you can say high heels. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Acuérdense, chicos, de encender su camarita. No necesitamos cámaras encendidas. Anything else? Any other words? Okay. All right. Very good. All right. So now let's take a look at this conversation. Please tell me if you can see conversation. Can you see it? Yes. Okay, very good. All right, so what we're gonna do is um, we're going to read the conversation, listen and repeat. Hi, Raul. Hi, Raul. Everybody. Hi, Raul. Hi, Raul. Good to see you. Good to see Good you. Good to see you. I want everybody, everybody in the class I'm participating, not just a few people. Where's Maggie? Where's Maggie? Where's Maggie? Oh, she couldn't make it. Oh, oh she, she couldn't make, make it. it. Um, she went to a concert with Alex. She went to a, she she went went to a concert, concert with Alex. Alex. Oh, well, why don't you and go and talk to Julia? Oh, oh well, why don't you go, why don't you go and talk to Julia? She doesn't know anyone here. She doesn't know, she doesn't anyone, know anyone here. here. Julia? Which one is she? Julia? Julia? Which one is she? Yeah. I repeat, Julia? Which one is she? Julia, which one which is she? Is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? No, she's the tall one in jeans. No, no she's, she's the tall, tall one, one, tall one in, in jeans. In jeans. Mm -hmm. She's standing near the window. She's standing near the window. The window. Oh, I'd like to meet her. Oh, I'd like, I'd like to meet her. her. All right. Any questions about the vocabulary or the pronunciation? No. No? No. Okay. All right. So let's practice this conversation uh, with uh, your with a partner, and I'll just put you into new groups. Okay. Um, tell me if you get the screenshot. Yes. Okay. Perfect. All right, so I'm going to make breakout rooms. Again, we're going to recreate them. Um, okay, here we go. Let's uh, practice the conversation. Here we go.
Ah. Voy conduciendo ahorita. Teacher. <risa> Roberto Carlos va conduciendo. Ah, ok. Let me change you. Ok. Gonna be lit. Hi, Raul. Good to see you. Where's Maggie? Oh, she couldn't make it. She went to a concert with Alex. Oh, well, why don't you go and talk to Julia? She doesn't know anyone here. Julia? Which one is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? No, she's the tall one in jeans. She is standing near the window. Oh, I'd like to meet her. Okay. 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 That's all? Yes, that's it. I don't know if you want to practice once again. <laughs> I don't know yet. Okay. 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 I'm gonna be live again. Ah, okay. Okay, don't worry. Start. Start. Sorry. Hi. Hi, Hi. I'm okay. Good to see you. Mm -hmm. Where's Maggie? Oh, she couldn't make it. She went to a concert with Alex. Oh well. Why don't you go and talk to Julia? She doesn't know anyone here. Julia, which one is she? Is she the woman wearing glasses over there? No, she's the she's the tall one in jeans. She's standing near the window. Oh, I'd like to meet her. Mm. Very good. Okay. okay. Practice one more time. Okay. I'm gonna be Liz again. And you, Anna, gonna be Raul. Oh, yes. Hi, Raul. Good to see you. Where's Maggie? We'll finish, teacher. You're finished? Yeah. Yes. Okay, great. I'll see you in the main room then. Okay. All right. Any questions about uh, pronunciation, vocabulary, anything you want to ask at all? No. The song uh, of glasses? Glasses. Okay. That's a very good question. Can you ask me that in English? Can you ask me that question in English, Anitzela? Um, I no sé cómo formular. What does? Uh, what does the sun is glasses? What does sun, what does glasses mean? 
but open up your microphone. What does glasses mean? What does glasses mean? Mm -hmm. Glasses are what you wear to look better, to be able to see better. So you wear glasses on your fa face, right? Okay. To be able to see better. Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Anything else? Anything else? No, Peter. Okay. All right. So in that case, we're going to move on to the next part. You see this? Yep. Okay, perfect. All right. So um, this is what we call um, modifiers with participles and prepositions. Okay. Basically, to be able to understand this a little better, we need to understand that these are like, it's like a type of relative clause. It's very similar to relative clause. Okay. It's actually what it really is, is it, it is a relative clause. It's just a relative clause that has been reduced. That's it. It's a relative clause that has been reduced. So it's like saying, for example, so who's Raul? He's the man who who is wearing, okay, who's wearing a green shirt. Yeah. So what we do um, what we do normally, like to make it simpler, to make it easier, what in English, we, we like to eliminate a lot of things. So we eliminate the relative clause, which is, in this case, who. And we also eliminate the verb to be, which is is. So you end up with um, Second, guys and girls. Ah. Okay, so basically the idea is that we are going to be eliminating both the relative pronoun who and the verb to be. And we end up with saying he's the man who is wearing a green shirt it becomes he's the man wearing a green shirt. The same thing happens if you are going to have like, for example, which one is Raul? He's the one who is talking to Liz. Who is the, he is the one who is talking to Liz. It's the same thing. We're gonna eliminate the relative, the relative pronoun who and the verb to be. That's why we end up with, the, he's the one talking to Liz. Is that pretty simple? Do we understand this? Yeah. Yeah? Questions? Okay, so. Now, that's with participles. Now, in this one, uh, we have with prepositions. So, who's Liz? She's the woman with short black hair. 
So here we can use, instead of using a relative pronoun like who um, and the verb to be, what we do is that we use just simply a relative, sorry, a, a proposition. So we say, um, she's a girl with short hair. Um, he's, she's the, the tall one in jeans. There are the people next to the window. They're the ones on the couch. Okay? It's like you just say in Spanish. She's the woman with short black hair in Spanish. Ella. Eh, you're going to have to open up your microphones. Es la mujer. Es la mujer. Con, um, con cabello corto, con cabello corto, negro. Negro corto. Yeah, exactly. Negro corto. Yeah, exactly. So, eh, la mujer con, right? Con cabello negro y corto. Okay, very good. Uh, next, she is the tall one in jeans. So we're saying in jeans, I mean she's wearing jeans. So it's like saying in Spanish, ella es... Es la alta con jeans. Good, ella es la alta con jeans. Or the jeans. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You're the people, you're, sorry, they're the people next to the window. Son las personas cerca de la ventana. Right. So, yeah. So, eh, ellos son las personas eh, a la par de la ventana. Okay. So, we use next to, next, next to, valga la redundancia. The, you use next to, next to the, the, um, the description of the people. Okay. Okay. They're the ones on the couch. That? Ellos son los que están en el sillón. Good. Ellos son los que están en el sillón. Okay. Mm -hmm. Any questions about that? Questions? No, teacher. No? So it's all clear? Okay. All right, guys. So we have come to the end of our class. Uh, mm -hmm. We are going to be taking attendance. So I want you to listen carefully for your name and uh, open up your microphone. Ana Isela Janis. Present teacher. Very good. Ana Ruth Perez. Present. Excellent. Carlos Ernesto Flores. Carlos Ernesto Flores. Diana Cristabel Melendez. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Gerardo Jose Te, eh, Tepas. I'm here. Okay, very good. Um, Jose Mauricio Martinez. Present. Okay. Eh, Juliana Margarita Sea. No, Juan, uh, Juana Margarita Sea. Eh, Catherine Suleima Pucar Sanderson. Present. Okay, very good. Um, Catherine Nicole Salazar. 
present teacher. Katy uh, Jordana dos Cruces. Katy Jordana dos Cruces. Eh, Laura Lizeth Peña. Laura Lizeth Peña. Eh, Lorena Araceli Hernández. Welcome to session 10. In this lesson, we will listen and practice a conversation between two people in New Orleans. See present perfect in contact. All right. Um, let's see. Where were we? Sorry, guys. Um, then me perdí. ¿Quién fue la última que, persona que mencioné? ¿Recuerdan? Did I, did I mention, um, Lorena Araceli Hernández? Lorena Araceli Hernández? Melissa Castillo uh, Beltrán? Melissa Castillo Beltrán? Mira del Carmen Ruano? Mina del Carmen Ruano. Oscar Otoniel Cruz. Present. Ok, very good. Eh, Roberto um, Carlos Alfaro. Roberto Carlos Alfaro. Eh, present. present. Ok, very good, very good. Salvador Antonio Martínez. Salvador Antonio Martínez. Sebastiana Guadalupe Aguilar. Present teacher. Good. Um, Tamara Eugenia Aguilar. Tamara Eugenia Aguilar. Y Úrsula Adriana Burgos. Úrsula a Adriana Burgos. Okay. Bueno, chicos, eh, that, will, that is going to be all for today and for this week. Remember, we okay. do not have class tomorrow. We had class on Friday last week, but because we were um, trying to uh, make up the class, right, from the, the class that we had lost, but we normally do not have class on Friday. So, um, uh, so you don't have to set, you don't have to worry about the weekend, but I'm gonna ask you to be constantly reviewing uh, during the weekend, especially because we're coming to the end of the course and your platform needs to be complete pretty much. Okay, so um, okay. work on the platform and um, I will see you guys um, later on, okay, next week. Okay. okay, guys. See you now. Bye-bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Thank you, teacher. You're How welcome. You Thank you, you too. Teacher. Ajá. Puede decirme, por favor, cuántas inasistencias tengo. Es que según, según yo recuerdo, no ingresé dos veces a clases porque me ingresaron y mandé la incapacidad. Pero ahora me escribieron que dicen que yo tengo, estoy muy baja con las asistencias y, y yo solo me acuerdo que he faltado esas dos veces, a lo mucho tres, pero creo que solo pedí permiso dos veces porque estaba en el hospital y mandé la incapacidad. A mí también me dijeron lo mismo por mensaje. Que, que yo tenía baja asistencia y que necesitaba completar la plataforma para poder compensar la, las faltas. Y yo ¿no? he pasado en todas las clases. Bien raro, ¿eh? quizás quizá es un mensaje para todos. Sí, quizá porque yo le escribí a la persona y lo que me respondió fue que me dijo que, que no, que, que sí aparecía y que ellos por suma hacían la asistencia, claro, pero yo paso conectado hasta con la cámara encendida todo el tiempo. Mm -hmm. 
¿Se aseguran siempre que su nombre esté completo en la plataforma? Sí, sí el mío está completo, José Mauricio Martínez Arabia. Uh -huh. Igual bueno, el mío, no creo que eh, Bueno, voy a tomar um, nota de eso y después les, les uh, comento eh, si hay algún inconveniente de, de acuerdo a la lista. ¿Ok? Ok. okay. Así de que... Uh, ok. Ahí nos estamos. Uh, bueno, yo le... Yo, yo les uh, me escribo si, si encuentro algún, alguna inconsistencia. Ok. Ok. Muchas gracias. Ok. Gracias. All right. Take care. Have a good night. Same. Have a good night. Bye.